why your music got so much pain to it? Why is there so much pain to all your music? Because that's how I express my pain. And all the pain in your music. That's how I get it out. I wait, I digest it, I go through it, process it, and I write that shit. So, yeah, man. So, I learned a lot today. And I'm really good that you came through. Thank you. And I definitely need to, like, get on your line and, and learn from more. Because you could be a mentor for me the way... The way I like how you see things. I appreciate the justification, that. John. That was that was crazy. That's, we need to get let that go viral. That was a good one. Yeah, because we we gonna be successful. Black people gonna be successful, right? African Americans, all those type of labels. But <laughs> for the sake of argument, I'm say African Americans. African Americans gonna be successful. Be hard workers. But that's not all we need. We need engineers. We need tech people that's you know, experience in technology and building infrastructure and grids. You know, when you fly in a plane, you get an understanding of what type of mechanics it take to create a society, because you got to go up and got look at the design of some something somebody put down. Like, we live and we down these streets, but we never get higher than the two stories of the house that we live in. You get what I'm saying? Some people, if you've never been in the airplane and you never lived in a third-story crib, you never even been higher to the house than you was raised in. Mm. You get what I'm saying? So it's like... You gotta understand that that's not by design. It's not by design that we don't have access to runways and we don't have access to aviation and sea navigation. It's not by design that we don't have access to STEM programs. It's not by design that they'll put a welfare program in our community before they put a vocational program in our community. It's not by design that they'll allow a bar to go up before they allow a supermarket to go up, a fresh grocery store to grow up. Mm. You get what I'm saying? It's not by design that, you know, all things down here is created towards taking money out of the community. They put everything right at your face. You got before you get to a fresh market to go do that. The 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 moralization, uh, the the the. the the morale factor is just gone because at the end of the day, you just roll past a Chinese store, a Jamaican store, an Indian food store, two KFCs, a McDonald's, a Popeyes, uh, some poppy stores, mm -hmm. an Italian spot. This Everything is not ours. Not even so much as that. The, the, they don't want you to be able to. They don't want you to be able to get it from the mud. Mm. Because if you teach a man to fish, he can provide for himself and his people. But if you give a man a fish, he'll be dependent on you. So they don't want you to go past all them stores. They're going to put everything in your way for you to stop. If you stop at one, they got the effect of you stopping at all. If you stop at any of them stores for anything, the goal is to take the resources out of the community. Them stores, where we spend our money, how we buy our clothes, our fashion, X, Y, and Z is geared at taking money out of the community. If I get rich and I got the money and I don't give back, y'all gonna be mad at me. But what the fuck, what about feed, Foot Locker? What about all the, what about that Chinese store? Y'all ain't never request that they give up food for a block party. Y'all ain't never request that they give away book bags to the kids. Mm. You've been feeding them kids them chicken wings all year. <laughs> yeah. So I'm gonna leave it there. If I got anything to say about Philadelphia is this, I love my hometown. I'm from here. But this is where I started at. This is not where I want to end at. If I die here, I feel like I fell. I don't want to die here. Nobody wants to finish at the start line. You shouldn't want to. And if you didn't realize that, your race and my race might be different. You might be a 40-yard dasher. You might be a 60-yard dasher. I might be a 100-yard dash. This man might be a running. Th my life, my track that I run on is my lane. Damn. You might want to do just that. You don't go all around the world. You might want to run for five seconds at a clip. This is how I live my life. If I could die in Casablanca, I'd be happy. This is how I want to live my life. That's how I want to live my life. I want to have enough money to travel and see the world. Just because 
I like to see shit. I like to eat different foods. I like to buy clothes from different places. I like to experience different things. Dub will tell you, I I tell him, when we on the road, experience. That's why I'm just beating in his head, bro. Don't get all caught up in that. This is experience. I want you to go do this, do that. And that's how we be, and that's how I've been for years. You know how people, many people from the city never even been to Chinatown? You know how many people from the city never been to the Philadelphia the Zoo? They, ne- they never been to the, the Franklin Institute. Oh, they, they never been to the African American <laughs> Museum. They, they, they never been to the Science Museum. Yeah. They never been. They, they, like they, they never yeah. been anywhere to even feel good about being from Philly to make it like uh, a real like credible experience. Yeah, like a real credible stance on you know. This is why I love Philly. Yeah, and they never been, they never really, been tourists in their own city. Yeah, you really love Philly, and you don't even, you never experienced it. Yeah, like, yeah.